Hey guys, it's me again, and I'm back with my second tutorial video for GTA 5. And this time, uh, I will be showing you how to make these awesome looking uh, curved, like twisted ramps that you can do like cool wall ride stuff or whatever with. And these are, these are pretty damn simple. Um, once you just learn the trick, it's all straightforward. What you want to start with is, uh, like I showed in my earlier video, there is this uh, switch the prop method where you switch from machinery to the ramps. And if you press A quickly enough, you will still be able to place down the ramp. But what you do, do is you just tilt it a bit, just like that. It's pretty simple. And then what will happen is, once you start putting these ramps on top of this, each other uh, because they're at a slightly tilted angle they will slowly start to curve and create that wall wall ride type of uh, curve and uh, here you can use the switch prop method for only the first three ramps and after that you will have to switch to the move method again and here you come from the behind of the ramp and uh, you just pull back the ramp and if you press A at the right at the uh, just at the right moment you will be able to place it on on the top of the ramp once it jumps up there even if it's red just like that and now you just keep building this and you can create all sorts of crazy snake type of uh, like uh, ramps and stuff like that there we go i'm not gonna make this perfect now i'm just gonna show you guys the basic method how to do this but you can you can work on uh, work on them on your own time if you want to make them perfect it will take uh, some time and uh, you, um but, but 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 it will it will really be worth it because like if, if you make these ramps perfect everyone will enjoy them and have a blast on your races you don't want to make shitty ramps that people are gonna hate and then they're not gonna play your races in the future and that's pretty much how it's done oh and right uh, of course if you want you can do the same method that i used earlier to make these ramps smoother uh, and what it is is you take this third ramp from in between there and then you you have to place it back in there so that the corner uh, ramp, a corner of the ramp will be above the, the ne next ramp, not below it like you see here. And then you just pick up the other ramps and you put them back in their original place, but you just pull them back just a little bit so they are not in inside or below each other, instead they will be above each other. So your uh, cars will not get stuck in these, uh, except maybe the Turismo. But yeah, that's that's it for this tutorial video. And I will be making one more to show you guys how you can make these awesome container ramps that you can get huge air of. Okay, bye!